Good morning, Mary C. Williams friends. This is Miss Britt here. I am going over the problem of the day from day 38 on June 2nd. Now, your wording on your actual um, problem on your daily schedule was a little bit different because in case you lost your book, you do not have this um, table. So the wording that we put in your daily schedule said, Ina is still buying things for her trail mix. She buys five eighths pounds of granola. So we find granola, that's how much she bought. And three eighths pounds of banana chips. Banana chips, three eighths pounds. Then the question is, how many more pounds of granola than banana chips does she buy? So we wanna know how many more pounds of granola she buys than banana chips. Now, you can set up area models or since it's um, subtraction, we're going to say she bought five eighths granola. We're gonna take away the three eighths of banana chips we know that when we're subtracting fractions, if the denominator is the same, then we can subtract. And we also know that um, since it is the same, it stays the same. Five minus three is perfect, two eighths. Now, I'm going to always check to see if I can simplify. What are the factors of two? One comma two, because one times two is it. What about eight? One times eight, two times four, and that's it. So I looked, do they have anything in common other than one? Perfect, they have a two in common. Since they have a two in common, I can divide by two, two divided by two, and eight divided by two. I have to divide the numerator by the same number that I divide the nom denominator by. Two divided by two is one, eight divided by two is four. So your answer is two eighths, but simplified, your answer is one fourth. All right, my friends, thanks so much. Hope this helped.